In the news tonight, guns stolen when bandits stormed GPL office in the city, sweeper cleaners are demanding better pay and working conditions, and the countdown is on to the biggest horse racing event, the Guyana Cup. News in Depth begins now. With tonight's edition of News in Depth, I'm Ifa Ward and thanks for joining us. A special constable was relieved of his firearm and two customers were robbed and three gunmen punks on the Guyana Pomolite office at Mount Repo, East Coast Demerara this afternoon. The business is located at the mall in the village. There are reports that the men, one armed with a handgun, took away the male security guard's weapon, tied him up, and then robbed two customers, one of $10,160 and another of $37,500. Gunshots rang out as the men made good their escape in a waiting car. Eyewitnesses told reporters that the same getaway car involved in the E-Networks robbery a few weeks ago was again used by the bandits. E-Networks has a branch in the same mall. The, the same crew come again. A young man who witnessed the entire ordeal said the men were not masked and moved very calm. Outside there, I see the guy come with a knife in hand. Come in, the guy pack it, take your phone, come down the stairs, and then after that, two guys will come out. You meet the, when you get the money, you fire a shot, come back to your vehicle, and you fire the next shot. And you go after it. One person? Two of them. Two of them. Well, one then get a top on the head, shot you cut up, and one then tall, and double it down. You get a red, red card, you fire him out. And you want the other one? No, I'm going to get a two guys. The police quickly got to the scene and took fingerprints and interviewed the security guard and customers. Residents in the area are calling on the police to be more active in that busy shopping area, which is now prone to robberies. The building has surveillance cameras outside that can help reveal the identities of the bandits. It's unclear if GPL has cameras on the inside. We will return with more news after this break. Hey, looky there. Let me go with the te techie te boots. Boots? No, mama, mama. I ain't gonna get a lack of teeth in them big stinky 30 second boots. Plus, it can be more cheaper online. And then got my favorite color, pink. Let me go on. Online shopping. Cheaper, faster, better. Pass back. Mimi. Hi, honey. Your family will love new Abbey butter spread. Heart healthy choice with no cholesterol, Abe is ready to use right out of the fridge. Smooth, spreadable, rich and creamy, Abe is a great tasting butter spread. Try it today. Eh eh, BB is way going with so much Windex for clean windows. All them fancy curtains, it's not even Christmas. Hi girl, mind your own business, I got big plans. But, BB, your house don't even have windows. Eh, hey, girl, you ain't think I know it ain't got window? Yes, I know it ain't got window. But look, Mokesh promised me that he carried me down by the window factory when he come home at Eccles. It named Beeson. Like, you know nothing, girl. Right now, everybody talking about how Beeson got the strongest windows. Plus, they got a deal right now. If you buy 10 windows, you get a free bathroom window. So I could mind you business instead of you minding me own. Beeson Windows and Doors. Serving Guyana with the highest quality standard windows for your home, office, or commercial building. John Lewis Styles proudly introduces Everest Bags, a complete and affordable line especially suited for back to school. Lunch bags from 3,500, backpacks from 4,500, pulley backpacks from 10,995. Also available are messenger bags, computer bags, waste pouches, duffel bags, gym bags, and even camping bags. All for the same price or less than buying online. And it's already here on Waterloo Street. John Lewis Styles, simply different. Welcome back. Sweeper cleaners are calling on government to pay them better wages and to improve their working conditions. Sweeper cleaners from across the country protested today in front of the Ministry of Finance, calling for the minister's intervention over the wages and salaries being paid. The cleaners are the ones who maintain the environment of the schools across the country. The cleaners said to compound matters, the condition of work needs to be improved. The 
the Guyana Public Service Union is the workers' representative, and the union executive stood in solidarity with the workers. First Vice President Marty Melivan said the systems are very unfair to the workers. We think it's very unfair in that they don't have any normal recognition that a public employee should have. And to make it worse, for the months of July and August, their salaries have been reduced drastically. For July, it is reduced to two weeks, and for August, one week. Liven said the fight for the workers' rights did not start today. The representation make was so good, great that in 2013, go back that far, the cabinet made a decision to pay these people the regular fee. But somewhere along the line, they never did. The sweeper cleaners vowed to stay away from the classrooms come September if their concerns are not addressed. Karibi Rice, from the lush rice fields of Guyana, straight to your home. Ruby Rice, our people, our rice. Here again, Jumbo Jet Auto Sales presents the 11th running of the Guyana Cup on Sunday, 13th August 2017 at the Rising Sun Turf Club, only 45 minutes from Georgetown. Over 15 million up for grabs and 8 exciting races. Come see horses like Spitfire, Princess She's Not, Just Call Me Boss, Goodwill Boy, Golden Blue Echo, Jack in My Style, Climate Change, Media Day. A newcomer, isn't he perfect? Scores even and more, battling Guyana's biggest horse race meet. Admission $2,000. Music by Traveler Sound System. Powered by Banks Bear. Come out and have fun in Banks Country. Before we go, let's tell you that horse racing fans are sharing the excitement about a Guyana Cup horse racing this Sunday. Feel good. It's different. It's, it's different from all the other horse races. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's nice. It's big. Everything looks good. Well put together. Well, I lately get into harsh racing, but yeah, I like it. I like, I like Diana, plenty multitude of clapping. I like this. People happiness. Beautiful. A fantastic achievement by Mr. Nazadi Mohammed, his son Junior, and his team. I'm a horse sports player and dry racing. It's very exciting. It's very exciting. I'm having a lot of fun. And it's an event that I always look forward to come to. I, I thank all the sponsors for coming out, especially coming to the race, not only being on board, but coming out here and seeing what actually goes on at the Guyana Cup. It's not a regular race event, it's a whole different level of racing. That's a wrap for this edition of News In Depth. Do join us again same time tomorrow for another edition. <laughs>